Hey everyone! So here in the Prefontaine house, my family always asks me to make my special cookie recipe. There's a really big secret to it though, so I'm going to let you guys in on that secret and we're just going to get baking. Obviously, there's some baker rules to do first. First thing, you got to put up your hair. So one second, let me just do that. Alrighty, I'm back with my hair up, ready to go. Obviously, don't want to make some gross cookies with hair falling in it. Uh, next thing you need to do as a baker, you need to wash your hands. So let me just go do that too real quick. My hands are all washed, give it a nice little, no more water. Um, now we need to be always organized, so let's get out all of our materials. Obviously you need a measuring cup, a little scooper, some spatulas, some more measuring utensils. And some big measuring cups and obviously a cutting board. Now here's the little secret. Make it look like you're all prepared to bake and make sure nobody's around when you make these cookies because the secret is too big to share with your family. Now all these things you thought you needed them, you don't. Push those aside and make your mom clean that up later. You guys are, have to be sworn to secrecy about this ingredient. Nobody can know except for you guys. This is a huge secret don't spoil it and let's just get on cooking. All we really need is this nice cutting board, a lovely knife. I'm not usually trusted with these, so please be careful when using a knife. And your baking sheet. Are you ready for the secret? Let me just go to my fridge and get it. All right, guys, for the secret recipe cookies, you use some baked by you cookie dough. Bam, easy peasy, tastes delicious, and nobody needs to know. Now, let's start baking. First thing, obviously gotta preheat the oven for these lovely masterpieces. You put it to 300 degrees, just because you want a nice chewy cookie, so let me just go do that. And the oven is now preheating. Next step, you just gotta cut this open. And I'll be right back with it unwrapped. And here we are with our final result of amazing cookie dough. If you want, just eat it raw, whatever you do. There might be eggs in it though, so be careful, not too much. So before we continue, just gotta be careful because we do have people like a Siri comments who uh, is a pro baker and chef and some others. So let's make sure these, those people don't see it from our 102 family because this is a secret for us amazing bakers that just need a solution. First step we gotta do is cut our lovely cookie dough into some nice circular, <laughs> not that one. Let me try again. Cut it up and roll into a nice little ball. Once it's rolled into a ball, all you plop it on the cookie sheet and just continue doing that. Now, I'm gonna go do that real quick and I'll show you guys the final result in a few minutes. Okay guys, so I'm just gonna show you what that looks like. Here they are, super just rolled, evenly spaced, and we're just gonna move on. The next step you need to do, just grab one of those spatulas I said you didn't need. And you're just gonna squish, squish them down. And I'm just gonna do that for the rest and I'll come back and show you the final result. Okay, so we got them all spread out, squished down, and now you gotta hide the evidence. So throw out that wrapper and just hide it under something in the garbage. That's what I usually do. And then they will never know. So we're just gonna plop these in the oven and we'll come back when they're done for our final result. So quick change of plans. I'm just going to go with you guys. We're gonna go check on how the cookies are baking and just see if we think they're almost done. And let's just do that. All righty. So we're just gonna open the oven, take a look. Oh, they're looking so great. We only really have 50 more seconds. I think we'll put them in for another minute and then we'll take them out. And we're just gonna wait uh, for the timer. Oh, there it is. The cookies must be ready. So. What we're going to do now is put on our oven mitts, take them out of the oven. They're hot, so be careful. 
Put the cookies down. Look at how amazing those look. Put them down. And they're just gonna cool on the tray for two to three minutes. And then we're gonna put them on the cooling rack. And then it's just clean up from there. Okay, so the cookies are now cooled on the sheet. So all we're gonna do is transfer them from here onto the cooling rack. And they're just gonna have to cool on there for a little bit longer. And then when they're fully cooled, they'll be ready to eat. And that's all we really want out of this. So let's just move on to cleaning now. Okay, final step, we just gotta clean up. The reason this recipe is so easy, we just have these three things, gotta throw them in the dishwasher. So we'll do that in a few minutes and then wash the pan after. Remember guys, this recipe is super duper secret. We can't let those pro chefs and bakers know and it's gotta stay between us. Cover up your tracks, don't let anybody know. They taste delicious and have fun eating them later. Enjoy, thanks for baking with me.